Hi guys, welcome back to the kitchen you guys. How is everybody doing today? Good, because we got another great video you guys. Yes, we do. So guys, today what I am going to bring you is my version of stuffed chicken breast. You guys, you got to try this recipe. I promise you, you will enjoy it. So what you need is some chicken breast. You need some, I use sweet peppers. Okay, as you see, I finally chopped them. And I also have some broccoli. Okay, and this is the fresh broccoli. It's not the frozen broccoli, but it's fresh and I finally chopped it. Okay, and let's not forget your Philadelphia cream cheese. Now, what we're going to do first is we're going to go ahead and we're going to set these aside because I need this room, you guys. I need this room. So, what I am going to do first is I am going to season my breast. Now, yes, my nails and, and hands are clean, but I'm going to flip it over on his back side and I'm just going to lightly season this with my home seasoning that I, I created you guys and the reason why I'm doing this first on this side is because once I flip it we have some black pepper so yes I'm going to incorporate some black pepper one may say that's a lot but it's not and we're going to put us a little garlic. Okay. And we're going to put a little onion powder. And those are the only seasonings that I'm going to use. And I'm just going to rub it in just like so. Okay. Wait one minute, you guys. Get me a towel. Just a... So... What we have, like I say, is some chicken breast. And we're going to flip it over on its belly. Flip it over. You guys, now, my next step is I have to get my knife. Ugh. So I have a new knife collection, you guys, that I ordered from Amazon. Let me show you guys. Order this from Amazon. And yeah, I really enjoy using it. As soon as I tried the one I was using, it came in a box of six. Wait one minute. Box of six. And I really enjoy this knife collection. Oh, I better be careful because they're extra sharp. So now, what I am going to do right here is I'm going to put me a chicken breast. We're going to set this aside. And we're going to put us a chicken breast just like so on here. Which way? Yeah, I want to go in here. And I'm just going to go in here and insert a nice little opening. A nice little opening. Just like so. I don't want to go quite down to the end, but just an opening such as that, like that to each one because we're going to stuff these chicken breasts you guys we're going to stuff this chicken breast oh yes I was in a mood for something different and this is keto friendly, I will have to say. And don't worry about how far you go. Just make sure that you don't open the other side of it. Like this one. This one was so thin. But what I'm going to do is insert another incision. Just so I can get past that. Let me set this knife over here. Now, 
Now, we're going to sit our chicken right behind me on the stove for a hot minute because I want you guys to see how I do this. Now, you have to have your cream cheese at room temperature. Room temperature works best. So what I'm doing here is I'm going to open up this cheese. Okay, so I need my knife again. Just to open up this cheese. And I'm going to drop it right in here. And I'm going to add me some, add the broccoli on in here. Just like so. And I'm going to give this a good mix. A good old mix. So I'll be back once I mix. Okay, so we have it pretty much mixed. And yeah. Now in this mix, I am going to add some pepper jack cheese. Pepper jack cheese. Just like that. Always make a little mess. And we're going to use a little mozzarella. Well, we might as well just dump it all in, right? And we're going to mix that on in here. Okay, so now that we have it all mixed in, we're going to go ahead and we're going to take our chicken breast and we're going to stuff it, you guys, we're going to stuff it. Just like so. I'll put a little more in there. Just like so. Now, yes, we're going to have quite about a lot left, probably. And it's okay. Because we can find something else to do with this recipe. You can stuff pork chops with this. I don't think it really would matter. Okay, let me wash my hands, you guys. Get this out the way.
So next, what we will do is now I will add a little olive oil. Just a little because it will help with, oops, but that's enough. I think we can get this one over here, over here, over here, over here. And like I said, the bottom of us is already seasoned, okay? Let me wash my hands one more time. And we're going to season this up. And we're going to move to the stove. So we're going to start with the onion powder. The garlic powder. Black pepper. And house season. And I'm just going to go ahead and rub that on in right quick. Rewash. And we'll see you at the Okay, guys, so we're going to go in here and we're going to turn this eye on. And we're going to add us a little more olive oil. Just like so. And over here we have a pan with some aluminum foil. We have our oven on 350. And I'm just going to spray that like that. We have our chicken breast right here. Why? Because we're going to go ahead and we're going to pan fry that before we put it in the oven. Gonna fry it before we put it in the oven. Now, let's make sure we get this oil all around here. And we gotta handle this with care. We're going to do two at a time. We're just going to pan fry it right quick. Guys, keep an eye on that for me. Let me know how it's doing. If you're a first time viewer, please thumbs up. And if you would love to join the family, I would love to meet you. Make sure you leave a comment below so I know where to go. <laughs> but anywho, most of all, I hope you enjoyed this video enough to like, comment, and share this video with you and everyone. This is real cooking over here. I try to give you the closest recipe to make it easier for you in the kitchen. <clears throat> Okay, so we gotta go ahead and we gotta flip this because we just wanna get a nice golden brownness on it. Let 
that's all we're looking for. It's a nice golden brown. Brown is on it. Because it's going to definitely cook in the oven. And we're just going to flip it just like that. Those are some very big old chicken breasts. Some very big old chicken breasts. Yes, see, I just wanted to get like a brownness on it because they will be going into the oven. Okay, so we have flipped them and yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, you guys, check it out. Let's check it out. Look at that. Let me show you guys what it's looking like. Look at there. So now we're going to slide this on into the oven. And we're going to let it go ahead and get juicy. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a shell on it. With some aluminum foil. Nothing tight. Just going to lay it just like that. And we're going to slide it in until we know that it's done. And then we're going to go for the brownness, you guys. So we'll be back once this is done. So, guys, there you have it. Some delicious chicken breast. Cheesy chicken breast. Stuffed chicken breast, you guys. This looks so delicious. Let's see if we can lift it. Oh my goodness, you guys. Check it out. Let me lift it up for you guys. So you guys can see. Oh my goodness. Let's get in here. Let's get us. My go to dish. Well, this is going everywhere. That is some delicious looking. Look at all that cheese sauce right there in this pan. That is hot. But anywho, there we go. You guys, let me, I like to clean up as a coat. So yes, if this is your first time coming to this channel, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I try to keep it as positive as possible, but yes. This is our chicken breast. 
our delicious chicken breast. Let me get a knife. Cut it for you guys. Oh my goodness. Let's cut right here. Goodness, you guys. You want the first bite? Yes. Look at that chicken breast. Juicy. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Mmm. Mm-mm. Mm -hmm. mm. You guys, this is so delicious. Now, I cook mine with the cover on it because I want to lock in the juice and it, let that cheese sauce come out. Mmm. But this is so delicious. It's actually a meal in itself. But I'm going to add me a little tossed salad with it. And that's going to be my meal. For today. Mm. So if you like this recipe. Share this recipe with any everyone. Let them know what your girl is doing on this channel. And yes you guys. Don't forget to thumbs up this video very delicious very very delicious so i am getting ready to close out i will see you guys on the next video don't forget to like comment and share and i'll see you guys have a beautiful day